Good evening ladies and gentlemen and welcome to another quick tutorial and guide on Satisfactory and today's guide is about autosave. So autosave can cause a little bit of lag when it happens. It's approximately every five minutes or should be exactly every five minutes and the, at the moment there's no way of adjusting the duration between autosaves in the menus and until they do there is a bit of a workaround. Warning. This workaround is editing small amounts of code. If you're not confident doing that, please don't. If you are comfortable, just maybe back up the files before you edit them. Uh, but if you're confident, still don't hold me to account if something goes wrong. I am not an expert in this. I picked up this technique through Discord and found a couple of Reddit posts and just confirmed it a little bit. So yes. Let's go. The location of the editable uh, file is inside the same folder of your saved games. So just to remind you, that is um, local app data, factory games saved, config and windows no editor is the full ad address, which I will put in the description below. But for now, we'll go through just so you can see it's in the same place. So that's saved. Config below if you've got many backups like I keep telling you to do. Um, and Windows, no editor. And the file we're going to actually open is the engine.ini. This should open as a text editable file and you should have what you see in front of you. Once you have this open, you will be copying in, uh, again, this will be down below in the description, the following text, uh, which is calling for the factory game save session script and the autosave interval adjustment. Now, the default for this is 300. Um, so type that in if you want to have it set back to the default. Otherwise, you can have it set to whatever you want. Now, these numbers are in seconds. So 300 being 5 minutes, 600 being 10 minutes, 1200 being 20 minutes. You can invariably make this as big as you want. There might be a limit. I wouldn't recommend this. I wouldn't recommend turning off autosave because it's actually very useful. But just set it to something which you think is suitable for you. I would set it to 10 minutes. That gives me roughly half an hour's worth of saved games to go back on history if I make a big mistake or I change my mind. Um, but it's still very useful. So setting it too high will actually be worse. So that's pretty much it. Don't forget to save. I want to say thank you to whoever discovered and shared this originally on Reddit. I don't know who did um, because it's been shared a few times and I've picked up on it on our Discord. If you're interested in the Discord that I'm a part of, um, I'll put a link down below again. That's Satisfaction Labs. We do the science so you don't have to. And lastly, if you'd like to watch me play, You'll find me at twitch.tv forward slash don't poke Josh. Drop a like on this uh, video to let me know if it's helped you at all. And do subscribe and I'll try and get some more out to you very soon.